Hi, my name's Lindsay Brenner, and I'm a local artist here in Albuquerque, and today I'm going to teach you how to make dream, dream boards or vision collages. And this is an example of one that I made. <laughs> so, um, to begin, we're going to um, find some old magazines or other types of materials that you can cut up and uh, make sure that you ask for permission first to cut them up. I found that you can find old magazines that are being given away at libraries. If they're getting rid of their old materials, you can ask them to use their old magazines for your collage. Um, and so we will look through the magazines and find images that represent what you want for your future or for your dreams. And then we'll cut out the images and you can also cut out words or draw pictures or write words um, to represent what you want for your future in your life. And then we're going to make a collage with all of our items that we find. And um, a collage is a collection of images or other materials combined and glued on a paper. And so that is what we're going to be doing today. And for the materials you will need, you'll need some old magazines that you have permission to cut up and you'll need some scissors and some glue or tape whatever you have nearby and also a piece of large paper or poster board or recycled cardboard that you can use as a surface to glue your collage onto so let's get started Hello, we're going to begin making our um, dream collages now. So first you need to find a surface to glue your images on. So you can use a piece of paper or cardboard or um, a recycled material. And I found this paper bag that I'm going to use today. And so feel free to just use some material that you find around your home that you can recycle and you can just cut that to a nice size for the back portion of your vision collage. So I just made kind of a nice rectangle shape. It doesn't have to be perfect because you're just going to be gluing on top of it. And so now I have my magazines here. And I'm just going to start flipping through them and um, look to see if any pictures or words jump out at me for um, things that I want to put on my vision board. So if you see an image you like, you can just start tearing out the pages and just flip through like this. And so I, put, I found a couple that I like already. And you can just keep going. And um, I found that it's easiest to just get a bunch of pages first. And then you can go back after you've torn out your pages. And then you can cut out each picture that you liked. Like this. So I'm collecting all my pictures, and you don't have to only get them from magazines. If you want, you can print out pictures from the internet, or you can draw pictures. But all of these pictures are going to be part of our collage that is a visual representation of your goals and dreams for your life. So this collage is going to make, be made um, for you by you. 
So everybody's collage will be unique. So I've collected some pictures before, so I have a pile of pictures that I can begin gluing. So if you want, before you start, you can lay out your pictures to um, sort of plan out your vision board first, or you can just start going and start gluing. So I'm just going to begin gluing and just make sure that you don't use too much glue, just a couple of dots for each picture. And um, each image um, that you find um, can be something that makes you feel happy or something that makes you feel inspired or gives you an idea for your future. And while you're creating your vision board, you can think of a few questions to help you think about um, your collage and your future. And some of those questions might be, what do you want to be when you grow up? What makes you happy? How do the pictures and words make you feel? And what is important to you? How would you like to spend your day? And who do you want to become? And where do you want to go? These might just be a few questions that you think about as you're creating your vision board collage. And you can also use pictures and words such as fun. So just keep gluing down and try to fill the entire page if you can with words and pictures that inspire you. So I'm just filling out my, my vision collage with lots of nice pictures that I've collected and words. And you can have small pictures or large pictures of any kind of image that you want because this collage is your collage and you can make it however you want for yourself. And um, you can also um, add more images onto your collage even after you're finished Today, you can add on to it, or you can, if you think of new ideas, you can write them down and add them onto your collage later. So, I'm still adding pictures on. You can just go slowly or quickly. And if you want, you can add some music while you're creating your collage so that you can get into a creative mood to be crafty and making something beautiful. So just keep adding on pictures and words. And don't forget that you can also write on your vision board or you can draw a picture. And um, just uh, make this as a little exercise so you can explore um, all the kind of things that you like and then you can see them um, on a visual collage. Still adding all my pictures that I found.
just keep adding more pictures and words and ideas until you think your collage is complete. And it's up to you whenever you feel like you've added enough pictures. So I added a lot of pictures of flowers on my collage because I love flowers and I want to I always want to have a big garden. So that reminds me that I want to go outside and see flowers and um, have a big garden at home. And you can even put different foods you like or places where you want to go or um, different ideas you want to explore in the future. So I'm just going to add more of my pictures that I found. I added some people smiling and jumping and having fun and some people swimming because I love swimming and I added some cacti because I love cacti <laughs> So this is your collage, and um, this is um, created by you for you. So you can create um, whatever you want on your own collage. Okay, I'll just add a few more of my collage words. word travel because I want to travel and I love traveling and I cut out wellness because I want to be healthy and stay well and kindness so I'm just adding all the words and pictures that inspire me and um, make me excited about the future so, um, I, I decided that my collage is just about done now, but I might add more to it later. So, this is my collage. So, you can, after you're done with your collage, you can display it in a place where you can see it every day so that you can be reminded of all the different things you love and... You can, if you have an idea for your future, you can write it or draw it and add it on to your collage and just have a place where you can find inspiration every day. And so that's my finished collage and I hope you had a great time making this collage with me. Thank you. enjoyed this fun activity and you got to explore your dreams and ideas for your future and you had a fun time making a collage and I hope to see you next time. Thank you. Have a great day.